in terms of Boris Johnson, how do you think his handling of Brexit has been? Do you think it will be, we'll get a deal, no deal? Look, Boris signed something called the Withdrawal Agreement, and it was all taken, taken to be a great relief after the agonies of Mrs May. The truth is, much of what's in that document makes having a Canada-style relationship virtually impossible. So Barnier's got a point, because Barnier calls it a treaty. He was walking around with it, leather-bound, under his arm. It's a new EU treaty, and he can't understand why Boris won't stick to it. By the time we got to the election, Boris was making promises that countermanded, in many ways, what was in, the, in, 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 in that withdrawal agreement. Um, do you know what? Uh, my guess is there will be a deal. My guess is it won't be perfect. I just don't know to what extent we'll finish up tied to EU rules. And that's my worry, because if we do finish up effectively with a level playing field, that stops us being competitive. Fishing matters too. They're the two things I'm looking for. But Boris also knows that if he drops the ball on this, people like me still exist. I could make his life very difficult. So look, I'm still, I'm still optimistic in a way that we get something half reasonable because his popularity is falling in many other areas. He doesn't seem to be enjoying being the Prime Minister. He's got some absolute duds as Cabinet Ministers that need to be got rid of and pick up, you know, pick some fresh talent from the back benches. So I think if Boris sells out on this, he'll be gone by the spring. So that keeps me hoping we'll get something that is maybe not perfect, but perhaps reasonable. Uh, fingers crossed.